have missed you guys. Like I have a lot of gist for you guys. Last week has been super eventful. This is BB Ninja After Buzz. My name is Obiana Ju, and I'm sure you want to know how it went down. So stick around. Welcome back, guys. It is still BB Ninja After Buzz. Where do we start from? So we saw the exit of two housemates, Tricky T and Ozo Emena, the lover boy. <laughs> Who is happy that Ozo has left? Because I think I'm happy. Yes. We are tired of seeing the guy follow a girl everywhere she goes. Like, how? What's up? But well, we thought Dora would leave. I mean, after what Dora did last week, we're thinking that she would go home. But nah, Ozo Mena and Tricky T have been evicted from the show. And when Ozo was asked why he was always following Nengi about, do you know what he said? He said that's how he is. When he loves you, he loves you for real. That's the husband I want. Some people think that, you know, he lost focus. Others think that he was just there being himself. You know, he went there for the money, but he was just being himself, being real. Let me know what you think. Do you think he lost focus? Because I think he did. Well, let me know what you think in the comment section below. Still on the eviction night, let's talk about Nengi and Ozo. So when Ibuka announced that Ozo has been evicted, you know, Biggie would now say, you have 10 seconds to leave the Big Brother house. Yeah, that thing. So. Also was hugging the housemates and he now went to hug. He wanted to just steal last minute kiss from his baby girl, Nengi Nengs. But guess what? Nengi curved him again. Like, ha, Jesus. I mean, V noticed it, Dorothy noticed it. But then, also sister came out to say that also is actually like that. Everybody should just let him be. He grew up as the only boy in the house. So he's used to that thing. Whenever he's just close to somebody, he wants to make sure you're happy. So guys, please, easy on the backlash with us or easy on it, all right? Now over to my favorite ship, the Kid Rika. Yes! So since Kid Wire and Erica left the show, a lot of people have said that they don't enjoy Big Brother anymore. I don't know if you guys are watching your own from the microwave or if you're watching it from TV because Big Brother show has just been on point. Well, let's talk about Kid Wire. Kid Wire has been making moves, guys. So he threw a party and of course his baby girl, Erica, was present. He didn't want her to be, you know, in front of the camera because he said she's still trying to build her brand. After what happened in the house, she's trying to be on her best behavior. But trust Nigerians to always find a way to take a picture or make a video. Well, Erica was looking so stunning that day. She wore a long see-through dress, but guys, that babe is hot. At Kid's party, we had some ex-Big Brother housemates present. I'm talking about last season. We had Shei Awolowo. Shei was making snaps, you know, saying winner circle. I'm like, <laughs> Shei is a winner. I'm not saying he's not a winner, but Shei did not trend per se that he's not giving us the whole winner circle thing. I didn't get that part. Toya was also there, Kim Oprah was there, you know, a couple of past Big Brother housemates and they were trying to, I don't want to say farms, but that's what they were trying to do, Sha. Either ways, it is what it is, right? Still on Kid Wire making waves, guys, Kid Wire appeared in a shoot. David O's music video shoot. You know, it was not so, it didn't really rhyme because it's his first time he's doing something like that. But at least it's something for him. It's something, it's something to his portfolio. He is really making waves. Erica had an interview with Ovation Magazine. I mean the CEO of Ovation, talking about Chief Daily Momodu. And she went there looking stunning, but not wearing a bra. Guys, the streets of Twitter went red. People bashing her, saying that how can she go for that kind of interview and not wear a bra, blah, blah, blah. But guys, Erica has perky boobs. <laughs> They're really small, so if she doesn't wear a bra, it's fine. <sighs> but no matter what Erica does, people always find, like elites always find a way to just, you know, make sure that what she's doing is right. They went on Twitter and started a hashtag no bra challenge for elite, talking about how you've got to free your boobs and do stuff like that. I don't know what they were thinking when they did that. I mean, if you want to trend, trend for something that makes sense. There was no bra day, what's that, please? 
But then again, if you do not want to wear bra, it is your body. Guys, learn to mind your business. M-Y-O-B. So we now have our top five for this season. We have Nengi, Dorothy, V, Neo, and Lekon. Who do you think would win the show? Now, most people say that it's Lekon because Lekon has been topping the chart since they won. Icons, I give it to you. I beg. You guys have been killing it. Voting for your guys. That's what I say. If you are actually rooting for somebody, make sure you vote. Don't just be rooting with mouth. Make sure your money is talking. Vote online, vote on the app, and also vote via SMS, you know. So people are saying that Lekon might win, then some other people are saying Nengi might win because of the whole sex tape thing. People are going to have to vote, blah, blah, blah. blah. I don't think so. I don't think so. But let's find out. Some people think Lekon would win because Lekon has been topping the charts, like, back to back. And it's not just 20%, like, 50%, for the something percent icons. I give it to you. Some others think Nengi might win because of the fact that this whole sex tape thing that came up, people are saying she might get PT votes, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. While some others are saying that Dorothy really has fan base and Dorothy might just end up winning the show since Tony Badge, Prince, Erica, and a couple of people are going to vote for her. They think that Dorothy Purchase might win. Who do you think will win? For me, I really, I'm thinking it's Lekon. Not really sure, but... From what we can see, I think it's Lekon. But let's find out. We'll be going on the streets now to ask people who they think would win. Is it going to be Lekon? Is it going to be Nengi? Is it going to be Dora, V, or Neo? I mean, yesterday on Twitter, I saw V for the money. <laughs> I know V does not really have a um, fan base. But I mean, if you're her fave, make sure you vote. Follow the icons. They don't just talk. Talk and then vote. Now we're moving to the streets to find out what the viewers think. Let's go. Who do you think will win the Big Brother Season 5 edition? Uh, for me, I'm hoping for Lekon. 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 Why Lekon? No, I just love the guy. Sure. Have you voted? I voted, yes. Lengi. Why Nengi? Because, I don't know why. But Is it because she's fine? Because she's fine. <laughs> when I like her. I think Dorothy. Dorothy, why? I don't, I don't watch often, but my, my family, they watch it, but based on their own estimation, Dorothy. So for you, it's Team Dorothy? Dorothy. Have you voted? They voted. If I go, for Dorothy. Leko. Why Leko? It's Leko. Why Leko? Because he do some funny things, um, you know. I don't use the work, but I just like the way Lekon behaves. Are you a musician? No. Some think Lekon will win because, you know, he has the fans. Some think Nengi and others think Dora and the likes. Well, Lekon's fans, I'm talking about Team Icons, they've raised 140,000 Naira now to vote for Lekon. So with the way we are seeing things, Lekon might just be the winner. But who knows? Big Brother's house, Big Brother's rules. Also, this week, Big Brother has said that every housemate remaining would have to be head of house for 24 hours. The first person started with V being the head of house. And guys, V has been doing really good on that job, really. I feel like she's putting all her power now because she knows that this is the final stage. We'll find out next week. Let's go. I think it's a Leko who will win this. Are you a musician? Nah. Why Lekon? No, nah, I prefer Lekon. Last year was uh, Messi. But this year, I prefer man this year. It's about man, woman now, Abi. Yes, me, I prefer Lekon. Thank you. Brother. Thank you. Who do you think will win Big Brother Lockdown Edition? I think Lekon will be the winner for this year, Big Brother Ninja. Why Lekon? Because he's one of my best actors in Big Brother's house. Oh, are you a musician? Today. Actually, I'm not a musician, I'm a comedian. <laughs> this will this will leave down for now for now because you're not <laughs> at shoes. Okay, right, no, no problem. Thank you. Okay, I think it's Mr. Leko. Why Leko? You even put Mr. Leko. Oh, Mr. Leko is because, he's because he's a man. Oh, yeah. It's about man and woman now. It's not fair. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's very fair because <laughs> the next one is for is for woman, but this one is going to be a man. Okay. Uh, Thank you so much. Uh, yeah. I think we'll win the season. I think I think it's Leko. Why 
Because it's very, very good to just for everybody. It's very nice. You like his music? Yeah, definitely. Hope you have voted. Yeah. All right, thank you so much. All right. We have come to the end of the show, guys. Keep it a day with me, same time next week. You can follow us on all our social media platforms at BB Niger After Boss TV. Also, follow our main page at Giddyfeed TV and follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at Giddyfeed News. My name is Obianiju, and this is BB Niger After Boss. Remember, Big Brother is watching, and Obianiju is analyzing. Stick with us. Purchase your tracks today.